breaking news welcome to today's headlines people said we wanted to islamize nigeria with sukuk but no one rejected 100 billion era sukuk bond fashion law speaks people said we wanted to islamize nigeria with sukuk but no one rejected 100 billion era sukuk bond to my dear listeners this is today's news minister for works and housing babatu de fashalal has disclosed how the floating of the sukuk bond by the federal government has done a lot of good in nigeria a sukuk is a sharia compliant bond in an interview with tvc Fashola said when the federal government introduced Sukuk, some people expressed fear that it was part of the federal government plan to Islamize Nigeria, but when 100 billion Sukuk bond was issued to be shared to be shared by the six geopolitical zones in the country, no one rejected the money. According to the former Lagos State Governor, money from Sukuk has been used to fund the construction of 75 roads across Nigeria. Today, Sukuk is generally accepted. In Fashola's exact words, I remember when we won, when we wanted to raise Sukuk funding. And people out of ignorance said, oh, they were going to use it to Islamize Nigeria. But that Sukuk funding is part of what is funding Lagos, Abel Kuta Road. That money is funding 75 roads across Nigeria. The first Sukuk was raised. During Mrs. Kemi Adeoshun's time as finance minister, and it was a hundred billion era. She said, Babatu de Raji Fashola, BRF, I have this problem. They said that some people are opposed to it, and I said, Just give me the money. We divided it into six for the six zones, 16.6 billion. Pazon and I said, let us call a press conference and ask any zone that don't want, that doesn't want, that doesn't want to cook money, to come out and say they don't want it. No one answered. So who doesn't want a Sukuk built road now? They are now asking for more. Minister for Works and Housing, Babatunde Fashalar has disclosed how the floating of the Sukuk bond by the federal government has done a lot of good in Nigeria. A Sukuk is a Sharia compliant bond. In an interview with TVC, Fashalar said when the federal government introduced Sukuk, some people expressed fear that it was part of the federal government plan to Islamize Nigeria but when 100 billion era Sukuk bond was issued to be shared by the six geopolitical zones in the country, no one rejected the money. According to the former Lagos State Governor, Money from Sukuk has been used to fund the construction of 75 roads across Nigeria, and today Sukuk is generally accepted. In Fashola's exact words, I remember when we wanted to raise Sukuk funding, and people out of ignorance said, Oh, they were going to use is they were going to use it to Islamize Nigeria. But that Sukuk funding is part of what is funding Lagos, Abel Kuta Road. 
That money is funding 75 routes across Nigeria. The first sukuk was raised during Mrs. Kemi at Oshin's time as finance minister and it was a hundred billion era. She said Baba to the Raji Fashola, I have this problem. They said that some people are opposed to heat and I said just give me the money. We divided it into 646 zones. 16.6 billion, Pazun and I said let us call a press conference and ask any zone that doesn't want Sukuk money to come out and say they don't want it. No one answered. So who doesn't want a Sukuk built road now? They are now asking for more. Minister for Works and Housing, Baba today Raji Fashalara has disclosed how the floating of the Sukuk, borne by the federal government, has done a lot of good in Nigeria. A Sukuk is a Sharia compliant bond. In an interview with TVC, Fashala said, When the federal government introduced Sukuk, some people expressed fear that it was part of the federal government plan to Islamize Niger, but when 100 billion era Sukuk bond was issued to be shared by the six geopolitical zones in the country, no one rejected the money. According to the former Lagos state governor, money from Sukuk has been used to fund the construction of 75 roads. Across Niger land today, Sukuk is generally accepted. Now I've come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment.